Hi, welcome to my channel EasyML. In this video, we will briefly look at how the random forest model will be built on the iris dataset. Recall that the random forest model is a classification model where we estimate the relationship between a categorical target variable and its numeric predictors, thereby helping predict the target variable. When I was explaining regression models, I had mentioned that the terms target variable, predicted variable, and y variable will be interchangeably used. Also note that the terms predictors and x variables will also be interchangeably used. I have the iris data set on the left hand side here. In this case, since species is the only categorical variable in this data set, species becomes our target or y variable. Similar to when we were building the regression models, we have two steps here as well. Step one is variable selection or selecting variables. Here, we have chosen the predicted variable as species. We will choose the rest of the variables as predictors. Remember, here when we are selecting variables, the only rule as such is that the y or the predicted variable has to be categorical. And it is preferable that the x variables or predictors are numeric in nature. It is also important to note that when it comes to classification models, the only way to be sure as to whether or not we have chosen the correct predictors is via trial and error. Now, step two, that is splitting data. Recall, when it comes to prediction, we need to have a training and a testing set. Only then can we evaluate the effectiveness of a particular predictive model. I had explained the importance of splitting data when we were building the regression model. For those of you who need a refresher, please click on the link provided below. In the next video, we will see how we can deploy the random forest model on the iris data set in R. Thank you. Stay tuned.